The Congregation for Divine Worship is the Vatican office in charge of all liturgical matters. That includes adding feast days to the general Roman calendar. The most recent example is the decree designating July 29th as the memorial of Saints Martha, Mary, and Lazarus. Before, this day commemorated Martha alone. The memorial must now appear on all calendars and liturgical books for Mass and the Liturgy of the Hours. The Holy See received various petitions to celebrate these three siblings on the same day. They offer a common witness of the Gospel message, and they were Jesus' friends. This change was made because in the past, some people erroneously thought that Mary Magdalene and Mary the sister of Lazarus were the same person. Many others, however, showed that this is not the case, and certain calendars already included the memorial of the three siblings. Studies from the 40s and 50s showed that Mary Magdalene was not the same person as Mary, the sister of Martha and Lazarus. That evidence presented an opportunity to add the three siblings to the general Roman calendar, in the same memorial, and the same day, because again, Mary Magdalene is not the same as Mary, Martha's sister. The congregation has also added the celebrations of Saints Gregory of Narek, John of Avila, and Hildegard of Bingen as doctors of the Church, a title they have held for many years. Their addition to the general Roman calendar will allow the entire Church to value the teachings of these three saints. They are important teachings, because the title of Doctor of the Church implies that their teachings and writings are truly relevant. Corrado Maggioni, Under Secretary of the Congregation for Divine Worship, says these changes to the Church's general calendar are an opportunity to let oneself be surprised and to learn from the wisdom of these doctors of the Church how to steadfastly live out the Christian vocation in these challenging times.